What's going on? It's your boy Guy by 2009. I'm back <laughs> again. Sorry about that. I had to switch it around and revamp it because I got so much I want to give y'all and I want to give it to y'all halfway. I apologize about that. Um, because I still got y'all names up here. Thank you, Q. Thank you, uh, Jamie Land. Thank you, Common Water, Michelle, Sky Eleven, Yulia, um, Miss K, Virgo Nation. Um, Common Water, Carla, Michelle, Madison, aka Maddie. I appreciate all the love. Thank you. I apologize about that. I had to revamp it because I want to make it good for y'all. Because I know I told I had promised one of my viewers I was going to do this on on uh, communication because I know y'all y'all been sending me a lot of requests. So I said I'm gonna go ahead and do one of the uh, requests because I know I can really do that like I want to because I really kind of wanted to like do this on my other the way I've been doing it like on the freestyle level but I'm not going to do that I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna uh, I'm make sure I had this one a little bit more written out because a lot of times just like I told y'all in the last video that I took down a lot of times we do get the um certain bad reputation for doing certain things and I know a lot of a lot of stuff goes unanswered and a lot of stuff goes with you know a mystery so I'm gonna try to make certain things clear for y'all. So I'm just give everybody a chance to come into the chat room. Y'all make sure y'all hit the like button so to so we can get the video out so everybody can enjoy it. So y'all make sure y'all do that for me. Y'all make sure y'all hit the like button. Um, give everybody else the chance to come in. A lot of ones that were uh, trying to watch the video last time, I'm giving y'all a chance to come in. That's all. I want to give y'all a chance to come in because I know a lot of y'all were trying to watch it the last time. But this one is going to be built on the communication. Why is it so difficult to communicate with us? Why is it so a lot of times so difficult to um, penetrate the the Scorpio? Why is it so? Why is it we? Why do we have this certain mystery, you know, mysterious aura around us and things of that nature? And I'm just going to break that down to y'all. I'm just giving everybody a little bit of time. Y'all make sure y'all hit the like button so I get the video out and get the notifications out because I know a lot of y'all tell me y'all get the notifications late is because Y'all got to hit the like button and share the video because once you hit the like button, it gets the notifications out there faster. So y'all make sure y'all hit the like button so the notifications can get out there so everybody can watch it. Because I know a lot of y'all tell me y'all get notifications late is because um, of the um, like support. So y'all got to make sure y'all hit that like button if y'all want the video to get out there like that. Because I'm only one person. Y'all got to remember that I'm only one person. So y'all got to make sure y'all support, show y'all love and support too. So get the video out there. I appreciate all the love. <clears throat> and this is just about Scorpio um, communication one on one. Cause a lot of times I realize um, a lot of people say we're we're hard to penetrate, we're hard to understand, we're we're difficult, but we're not really that difficult. But a lot of people never really get that chance to understand us because they either end up goofing up, I end up saying something crazy, I end up doing something crazy that's completely you know out of character for their sales but it's like just like i told you it's like people wait for a scorpio to right walk into their life it's like once they deal with us and once they learn us and once they fill us out and figure out you know who we are as a as a people personally it's like they bring out the worst sides of their character they bring out the worst sides of their sales to dump on their plate when they come to deal with us any type of relationship any type of friendship even in kinship where where we related to this person we can i i can't even begin to tell y'all because i've really been backing up on this because i know i don't know who watch my stuff i never know who watch my stuff and it's not like i really have any type of big you know worries or cares because any just like i told y'all anything that i say behind this i'll say it into a person i'll say it quicker in a person's face than i would say it up here a lot of times i hold back on my own personal experiences because i don't want to put people on blast but at certain times you got to share your certain experiences because it's your personal testimony and a lot of times you can help other people you know even as uh my personal experience as scorpio dealing with like people that i actually knew people i grew up with people that i i give my last to they'll be the the last ones you know in the i'll be honest like in the last three years the people that i, I would would have died gave my life for you know, any any given day, they, they were the last ones to help me. They were the last ones to support me. They, they were the last ones to show me any encouragement on any of my dreams. They were the last ones to be there for me when I was sick and laying, 
you know, laying up real bad and trying to, you know, get myself to get. It's, it's like a lot of those same people that we give our energy to out as Scorpio personally, a lot of that's that same energy we get a negative backlash in return. Uh, we end up becoming what people when it comes to, you know, reaching out to people when it comes to being open as a whole, because it's a lot of times it's, it's like, what's the use? Because a lot of times we would get the backlash. That's why a lot of times in, in, in wonderful relationships that I, I've been able to, you know, been able to experience is because I was able to, you know, grow and to learn. And, you know, seeing by meeting y'all, meeting different people and being able to experience different things, it, it teaches, it helps us, us as Scorpios to, be more open because by all the bad experience that we have, it takes it takes us a while to open up to certain people and even certain people that don't deserve to get that certain test or get those certain grill, uh getting grilled a certain way or get chastised in a certain way. It's not because we're trying to be evil or mean to you in, a, in a, any in type of way in particular. It's because of these enormous, these horrible, um, bad experiences that, that we have encountered. You know what I'm saying? It's like no, like all the people that that have pushed me, like, and I, I thank the Lord for all of all of my you know supporters and all my subscribers, but because y'all not because of my channel, because of any attention I'm getting, or because of anything like that in particular, it's it's because of the more simplistic things that that you don't realize. It's because you've been able to sit here, y'all y'all been able to support my videos, just y'all watching my videos, support my videos, telling me, hey, God, buddy. I appreciate what you're doing in the comment section. Hey, God, buddy, thank you. You gave me something that's going to help me put, that's going to help me and, and taught me something. You know, a lot of times I tried to get, when I first, y'all don't understand, yo, when I first started my endeavor on trying to do my my thing up here, like I, I, I wanted people to help me, give me certain pointers, help me with certain editing tactics, help me with certain um, scripts, uh, help me with certain ideas, help me with certain uh, camera equipments. Help me with certain points. Absolutely nobody was there. All, all these, all these same knuckleheads, all these same dodo birds, the same ones that I would lay down my life for in a second. They were, they were the first ones to turn their back and do absolutely nothing. They did absolutely nothing. They didn't. They didn't even want to hold the damn equipment. They didn't even want to give it. They didn't even want to give it a look. It, it showed. But at the same time, it's, it would. It didn't hit me in the way of being better. It hit me in the way of seeing people for the true people who they really are. It, it showed me the real characteristics and the real psychology of how human beings act, of how they they approach you, of how they they come at you, uh, how, who they really are, where their heart and soul really lies. Because a lot of times, they're not these wonderful, these soulful people that they appear to be. And, and, it, and a lot of times, it's easy for us to get the finger pointed at us and get the bad guy. We can wear that. That's, that if that's how people want to paint us, I paint us as these people, as these bad guys. That's fine because once you know that, know the truth, and you know what's the reality of how you dealt with people, how you, how what type of situations you've been through, and your you don't have to explain. It's it's already written in stone. It's there. You don't have to pretend. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to um uh do certain things. It's like in in a certain way. It's like it like like man. It's crazy. It's like when you when the people feel like. Like when they dealing with us at Scorpio, people like they feel that if you're under them or if you're less than them or they feel that you you have less than them or that you you're not smart as them or they feel that they feel like it. And I'm using that word very very loosely. They feel like it. If they feel that you're a certain way, you you ain't nowhere near this. But they you gave them an impression that you coming off this way because like I told y'all, people take stuff for cover book cover value you give them oppression that you coming off this way it's like they want you like that they rather keep you under their thumb people don't want you to be the man right next to them they don't want to look at you eye to eye they want they they want the little they want the little uh idiot or the little lame that sits under their elbow comfortably i'll let you head butt them like a like a freaking maniac repeatedly with blood gushing down your face with a big smile still on your face without showing any type of human emotions, without showing any type of human reaction. You're not supposed to feel any type of way. You're supposed to keep the same golden red carpet laid out for them, even after they raised hell, even after they show you all their worst characteristics. You're supposed to keep this same smile. And that's the same thing that I, I dealt with, dealing with my own, dealing with my own people. It's just like, 
And people be like, man, God, body, we, we, I know y'all, some of y'all believe, some of y'all don't, but I use it as parables because it's cause just like in the word, it's just like, it's, it's the best. I use this as examples because it's real. It's just like, like what they say, like, like in the word says, it says even a prophet in his own hometown is a prophet only in his hometown is a prophet without honor. Because of the same people that I, I would I would break my neck for, same people that I grew up with, same people that I, I helped with at a at a deep level of respect, they were the last ones to help me. They were the last ones to support me. Do y'all realize I never shown anybody that I, I've grew up with around that about any of the stuff I endured, about any of my, my God body 2009 stuff? No. I tell y'all, y'all were the real God body 2009. I tell y'all, y'all, when I tell y'all, y'all really built my channel. I tell y'all that because it's serious. I didn't get no support. I get no thumbs up from my, my brothers, I, from my sisters. I be like, oh, you're going to do such a wonderful job. And that and that's that puts a stigma in our mind. That puts a stigma. People don't see this type of stuff, but they, they only see us avoiding to be around people. They only seeing us giving people the the uh, the stiff arm because they we're being difficult. Are only giving people a certain attitude, a certain glance, a certain um, shade because... We're being we're being moody. We're being dark. We're being these evil characters. But they don't. It's not. It's and if you're looking at it from that point of view, you're never going to understand the realistic the the reality of who you're dealing with, of the individual you're dealing with, of the man you're dealing with. Because it's a whole. Uh, giving y'all. I'm just. I'm just giving y'all. I'm just giving y'all a little something. I told y'all. I'm giving y'all a little something. Some. Um, I'm gonna check on y'all right quick. I told you, like I do, I push it out, the info out. And and a lot of times, just like I tell y'all, like, y'all don't even see what be going on behind the scenes. Y'all see people be 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 this, be like, oh yeah, God body, we like this, but can you do this? Can you do that? Can you can you flip it like this? Can you put it like that? Oh, you can change up this. Oh, do that. Can you fix it like this? Oh, did you forget that? No, uh, can you lower it to this? I don't have a faculty uh, of a million people in different cubicles controlling everything. I'm doing this dolo, solo, me, me, only me, just me, nobody else. I, I promise you, it ain't no, I don't have a faculty of people controlling everything. So y'all got to understand when I ask y'all to do something, or when I come at y'all straight, that's how it is. I don't have to beat around the bush, I show anything around the corners, and that's how we communicate. You got to understand a lot of times that a lot of you, when y'all hit that brick wall, when they're dealing with communications, y'all get easily discouraged which is not going to really help you um, at all when you come to dealing with any type of realistic relationship or any type of situation. Deal with a Scorpio, man. Hit that like button. Y'all make sure y'all come in. I appreciate all the comments. I appreciate all the love. I appreciate all the hearts and everything. But you got to make sure you hit that thumbs up to show that love. That it, it solidifies it. It gives me confirmation that you with it. You know what I'm saying? You That you, that you really here 100%. You know, a lot of times... <clears throat> I hate when I do that. Y'all use me. Y'all make sure y'all hit the like button because I want y'all to get that out there. Where was I? Where was I was, where I at exactly? Where, where did I leave off? Because I don't want to, because I always get lost and I don't want to tell y'all, give y'all the wrong thing. It's, you know, I, I I been I get so deep into it that I I forget where I left off. If y'all can let me know where where was I? Cause I'm I'm getting deep in this now, so y'all got to help me out sometime. I'm getting like an old man. I told y'all Scorpios be like old men sometimes. We get we just we 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 got so much wisdom. I, I told y'all I was just thinking about it today. Just like I told y'all, a lot of people want these coloring book dudes, but we're not those type of individuals. We're, we're these encyclopedias. We got encyclopedia of wisdom. We got encyclopedia of knowledge. But you got to understand, even though people say they they rather deal with these these brilliant individuals, or they rather be around more enlightened individuals, or they rather be around these strong characters, or these strong individuals with these passionate um, personalities and things of that nature. When they finally meet these people and they finally encounter these individuals, they don't know how to. They don't know how to take us. They don't know how to deal with us because we're so unorthodox. When we're so um, what they're accustomed to dealing with, they used they're accustomed to dealing with idiots. They're accustomed to that regard thing they know. Everything that they learn has been something that's been repeated by other people. 
Let me see. Y'all let me know where I left Dolph on the uh, other part, part too. If anybody let me know, y'all let me know, man, because I want to make sure I'm on the right part with y'all because I don't want to skip nothing. I ain't even started. I haven't even read from the notes yet, but I told y'all I'm coming with it today. I don't I don't ever want to give y'all nothing halfway. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna do some compatibility. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do the compatibility, but I'm gonna do those more on the upload type of base. I think it'll be more fun if I do those like on the upload like I used to. Yeah, and just like I told y'all, like it's only a few people, and like it's only a few people, and we realize that we're not the type that be, we're not these, uh, we not try to be these antagonists. Just like I tell y'all, like like I use in the books, I told y'all I love writing, I love reading all the time, so I'm really big on characteristics and using those terms. So a lot of times we we are easy, we are easily put as the antagonist in the story, the bad guy in the story, the guy that can't never do anything nice in the story. It's easy for us to put in that situation because nobody's never going to look at it in a realistic term. It's always going to be in a term where they're going to only put it in their own way. There's never going to be in a realistic light. It's always going to be biased. And when you're dealing with a Scorpio, we're not going to be biased, not even not even to protect our own image. Because people, when people say, oh, Scorpio, uh, they tell the truth about everything but themselves, that's not, that's not the truth. I'll be seeing that. That's not the truth. We, we are the person, we are the same person that will burn our own bridges. We will burn and sting our own selves and destroy our own image and, and rebuild our image from scratch. We're not the type, we're not biased by, by looking at ourselves at, at all, not by the least bit. We are the type of people that will be extremely critical. We are our biggest critics. We are extremely critical of ourselves and of our personality, how we are perceived, how we are, you know, direct when it comes to how we communicate and communicate towards people that's why when people accuse us of being a certain way of accusing us of overlooking certain aspects of ourselves it can it can hit a nerve because it's irritating when you know you scru you scrutinize every little thing you do you already scrutinize it and then somebody come along and tell you you know you ain't doing enough you know it's like when you it's like you know yesterday you were you were uh you was going through rehabilitation, you couldn't even lift 10 pounds. And, you know, six months later, by the grace of God, you bench your 200, you bench your 250, you bench your 300. You know, this is this is a miracle. But then somebody tell you like, eh, for your for your size, you could at least be doing 350 or 315. Or, or they come around and tell you, oh, my cousin can do 350. And you know, like, 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 I don't care what he can do. I know I'm doing something. I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing is, is something extraordinary. I don't need. I don't need your cosign. I don't need your. Just like I told y'all in my old videos, those that you that's been around for a real long time. I'm talking about my OG viewers that's been around since day one. Y'all know when I say like we're not looking for that two thumbs up. The video is not even up here no more. But we, I, we're not looking for your thumbs up. We're not looking for your your slap on the back because we know even that. It's, it, it can be it can be temporary. It's only temporary praise. It's not real artificial. It's it's, it's not authentic. It's it's, it's art, yeah. It's artificial. It's not authentic. You know what I'm saying? It's temporary. It's temporary praise. It's just like people throwing up a Facebook post, uh, throwing up an Instagram post. It's it's and people don't understand why you getting such. Why do you feel so low? You have all these Facebook friends. Why you feel so bad? Why you end up feeling so depressed? Why you feel so bad? When you try to communicate, but you got all these Facebook friends, you got all these profiles. Why can a person feel so lonely? You got to understand that's not reality. That's that's not only reality. People say, yeah, art imitates reality. Yeah, but only reality can re can imitate reality. Let me get that for. Let me get that straight. Only reality can imitate reality for real. For real, you can tell the difference. You can tell the difference. You try to reach out people. Half those people that be on your page, you can't name 10 of them, they'll reach out to you. Anything happen to you, how many of them that you know you can call? Y'all can say, God body, hey, you see me sometimes, God body, you don't say nothing to me. 
But if you reach out to me, I, I will reach out back to you. If, if you had thousands of people reaching out to you 24 seven, you got to understand that I'm only one person. But in reality, y'all look for people that don't have nobody, nothing to do. Y'all, these same people won't even give you a like. These same people won't even share your video. You could put a graduation, your son graduating and everything, and you're doing wonderful and you you rehabilitated and you just got this done and you got this procedure done. They won't even show you no love. And y'all end up feeling this emptiness. Y'all end up feeling this this void. Y'all end up feeling this 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 hole that needs to be filled because it's not real. That that stuff is social media is 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 not really social. It's not really communication. It's not really reaching back to people. It's fake. It's an imagery. It's not it's, half of those people are there only to be nosy. Half of them only there to be jealous to hate and sneak dish you. Half of them only want to be there just to be there just because. Half of them are over half of them are there just because. Even your own personal kin, even if they like every video you ever done, they they probably your biggest hater. They probably they probably waiting and praising for the day you fall flat on your face and, and hurt yourself. These same individuals that y'all y'all put all your energy into, you put all these posts and then y'all end up feeling the. It's because it's for a reason. It's not for no reason. It's because it's not real. And us as Scorpio, we we know that already. That's why people say, "Oh, they anti-social." No. We very social. We we real tie social. We we not gonna fake tie social with you. We we not we we gonna be very anti social before we be fake tie social with you and BSing, sitting around there acting like we friends. You ain't friends with me. You won't even give me a high five. I send you a hundred times on my Facebook. You won't even give me a high five. You won't even look at <laughs> half of you won't even look at each other when y'all see each other in person. But y'all y'all high fiving on on Facebook and throwing up two thumbs and happy face emoji. <laughs> It don't work like that. Come on now. We grown. We grown people. Can I talk right now? Can I talk to y'all? Are we grown? Are we adults? Are we not kids in here? Okay, cool. So I'm going to keep it like it is. Let's just keep it like it is. You're not going to get any type of any type of anything from that. You're not going to get it. Instagram, none of that is going to give you any type of spiritual satisfaction. It's not going to give you any type of refuel. It's not going to give you that energy which you give in return. It's not going to happen like that. It's not going to happen like that. You've actually got to reach out to people. You got to actually talk to real people. You got to be around real, authentic people. Only authentic people can give you real, authentic energy. You ask, I don't give a damn if you ask a million fake ass people for, for good feedback, for, for energy to refill you in your life. They're not going to give it to you. They're not going to have it for you. You know what I'm saying? And going on these places, you, you're looking for nothing more. You better off flipping through a tabloid. At least you have something to laugh at. At least they have some funny stories. Half of these half of these people out there only regurgitating posts that's been posted a thousand times, jokes that's been said a thousand times, celebrity news that's been reposted a billion times. Come on, man! You know A A B C D E F G. We already know that. Let's switch it up a little bit. We don't have to keep doing the same thing. All y'all want to do is the the same cookie cutter communication. Uh, celebrity gossip, uh, 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 political gossip. Uh, 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 what, what else? What else? The fuck people be talking about? BS. Uh, uh, material gossip. I don't want to hear that. We don't care about that. We can go to anything and talk about that. I don't care about how clean your sneaks look. I don't care about how nice your joint look. It's, I'm happy for you. Cool, but it ain't none of my business. I don't want to know that. I don't want to know your baby poop on your own self after you put her new dress on. That's none of my business. If you're talking about real stuff that actually makes a convenient difference that really, you know, do do the same thing, it's, you know, it's crazy, man. It's crazy. Y'all make sure y'all hit that like button. Y'all make sure you show that love, you know? Uh, oh yeah, uh, Mr. L, uh, whoever it is, you you won't get you get removed for show, my brother. You messing with the wrong one, wrong. I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you like like uh, Lil Cuz said, you messing with the wrong one. Uh, sorry, th this the wrong person, wrong page. Sorry, wrong person. You coming up here to troll and BS. Sorry, wrong person. Next, you gonna get blocked. You gonna get all that. 
wrong person. This ain't Mr. Happy Face. Wrong person. I'm not going to tolerate it. You say something crazy, you get X'd out, period. Wrong. You got the wrong one. Um, you might get the right one because I'm going to deal with you head on. Come stop you come off here saying something crazy. I'm not gonna tolerate it. That's what a lot of that's a lot of times we don't we don't open up to everybody. We don't we don't talk to everybody. Uh 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 whatever your name is, Jugger, you you're gonna end up getting X'd out, you're gonna end up getting blocked because you acting crazy. That's the that's the same reason we don't uh we don't uh reach out to people. We don't rock with people because they always come with different mess. They always come with some mess. I'm going to handle this person real fast. You you want to talk to me? What you, what you want to talk about? What you need to talk about to me? You better talk real fast because you're going to be talking to nothing because you're about to get blocked. What you want to talk about? What? what? What you want? Next. I ain't got time for it. If, you, if, he, say, if he say anything crazy... Make sure y'all block him. My moderators, make sure you block him. If he say anything crazy, block him. I'm going to let you talk, but if you say, yeah, go ahead, block him. See, every time you know you're doing something when people come in, they, they come and try to interrupt. Y'all make sure y'all remove him. Y'all just remove anything he say. And anytime he try to talk, y'all y'all remove him. Don't even let him talk. Y'all make sure y'all hit that like button. I appreciate all the love. Thank you so much. People want people were so hungry for attention. And y'all y'all see this. Y'all see y'all see how people act. Y'all see what y'all see what I deal with. Y'all see how people be acting. Y'all see how people be coming. Uh, you because you ain't gotta worry about him because he ain't gonna be up here anyway. He he can't he can't say nothing no more. Cause a lot of times, see y'all now y'all see that's a good example. I'm glad you came. Thank you, L. Uh, 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 retard. I, I appreciate you, Mister Retard, because you put a good example of why people don't want to be on social media, why people don't want to deal with people no more, why Scorpios, why we keep people at a distance because you gotta deal with retards like this. Thank you, Mr. Retard, for coming over. L. Uh, Stupido, L. Uh, Lamo, whoever you call yourself. Thank you. You show that's a perfect example. I'm glad you came along. You see how see, you see how it take how fast it, it happens. You see how irritating and how annoying that is. In real life, L. Stupido would never say nothing to me. In real life, L. Stupido wouldn't wouldn't even look at me the wrong way. In real life, El Stupido wouldn't have absolutely no problems. El Stupido wouldn't even have a voice in real life. But he failed because he's up here. He has an extra voice. He has an extra muscle. He has an extra uh, uh, vocalism. But it don't. You don't got no. You don't got no muscle around here, homie. Sit down. or you gonna get blocked? Like it's it's so easy. You know what I'm saying? Like it's so easy to run into BS. It's so easy to run into all these people that's disgruntled, all these people that, that don't have no life, all these people with the weird per, you know, personalities. They all want to come around you and bring all types of craziness. That's why people have their stuff on private. That's why people set their stuff to private. That's why people don't like reaching out to comments. That's why a lot of times I, I would get, I used to, I ain't going to lie, I used to get irritated like, because as, as Scorpios, we're very direct with people like, if I go on somebody's video and I, and I comment and they they just hit the like button or they don't say nothing back, I can understand if I was one of those trolly type people that say nothing back. But some of these people, you'll say one thing to them, they act like they can't even say nothing to you. They they don't have no type of direction. They don't they don't know how to communicate with you. They'll 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 comment on people with no type of face picture, but you have your face picture, a whole page with a bunch of videos, but you ain't gonna say nothing to me though. But you're gonna answer a person that has absolutely nothing under their stuff. It's, it's crazy. People are, are so stupid, so freaking strange. People will be next to you and walk beside you and have all this and that the third to say on on some on, at a distance. But when you in front of them, where's the where's the same energy? Where's the muscle? Where's the confidence? Where's all that tough guy? Where's the tough guy? Where is he? Where's the loudmouth lady? 
where is that where's that big broad muscly guy that was that was talking to me and calling me the n-word where are you where it where is it why i don't see y'all because y'all i don't i don't i don't hide I, I be everywhere. I be in. I be in all the social gatherings. Where's you tough guys? I don't see none of these tough guys. That's why a lot of times people, uh, Scorpio, we don't communicate with everybody because these weirdos, these haters, these 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 demons, they come out of nowhere. Y'all see, y'all see it. I spoke them right on up. Y'all just seeing. Y'all not even seeing a pinch. Y'all not even seeing the salt of what I had to deal with. And that's why a lot of times Scorpio. That's why. <clears throat> Y'all, y'all say, "Oh, me and uh, Miss Scorpio Moon, we being mean? Are we being being shrewd? Are we being very blunt? Are we being very evil?" But y'all don't see that we're getting trolled by millions of people. Y'all don't see that we get get all types of of uh, comments, all types of people. We gotta block all these maniacs, people that comes, and that makes Scorpio not want to deal with people. That makes us not want to. Every, everybody that we deal with, we gotta scream them because we don't know where they coming from. We don't know what rock they trying to crawl from under. You know what I'm saying? And that can make you not want to communicate with people. That type of shit make people block people. That type of shit make people not be friendly towards people. And I understand it. That's why I understand why people don't be direct when they talk to certain supporters. And it, and it sucks because it makes everybody get put under the same under the same banner because everybody's not trolling. Everybody's not here to, to BS and waste your time. Everybody not looking for something out of you. And, and, and it's not just for the dudes. It's not just the dudes either. It's the, some of the women too. Like everybody not trying to get in your pants, lady. Everybody don't 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 think you all that hot. Some people just want. Some people just like your content. Some people just might like might like what you're talking about. You know what I'm saying? I know it's hard to believe because you 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 get your hair pots kissed, you get harassed, you get sexually harassed, you got people pulling at your coattail. But no, nah, we not we not coming like that. We're not going like that. That's not how we we do things. Y'all make sure y'all like as y'all enter. Let me write my links in here because y'all y'all don't y'all don't just come here and just look and then don't show no love because y'all don't see people be be trolling us, be trying to copycat. People be trying to uh, get their their voice in and and make little diss videos. People be trying to imitate. It's just like what Pop said in the song. He said all these these player haters and these imitators. Steady swinging made me want to stop back banging because it that's because that's what it is for real. It's so many damn haters, imitators, and player haters. That's all it is in 2019. And, and they and they and they show it with oh, oh, this man, they have every excuse from the book, then to call it what it is. People will do everything, people will say anything evil, but when you direct with them, they don't know how to take that when you up in their face. They don't know how to take that. <laughs> you use all that that ritualistic stuff, but when I'm direct with you, dead up in your stuff, you don't know what to do. You call it for backup. You looking for help. I'm, I'm, you you run, you barking up the wrong tree. You know what I'm saying? When you're dealing with us, that's why a lot of times we we rather avoid that hassle. We rather avoid that trouble. We rather avoid those confrontations. That's why you will get those Scorpios being difficult. You get a Scorpio, um, you know. Handling people with a long handle spoon, or dealing with people at a certain number because it's so much to deal with. It's so many haters. It's so many people with hidden agendas. It's so many um, lames out here that just want to bring their their low vibrational energy. They bring their hating energy. They they need that just just like that. He he needed that. If you, if you think you got a little bit out of me, okay, bro. Yeah, you got a little bit of my attention. Wow, you got. Two three minutes of my attention on a video, that that, that that's all they. But if, for real, for real, I shouldn't even gave them that much. But I'm not scared of anybody. But I'm not gonna. It's, that's what they want. They want your energy. They want to suck off our energy. They want to deplete us of everything. They want to belittle us. But they're not gonna stand. They're not gonna. These same people won't even look you in your face. They won't even look you in your eye. You know what I'm saying? And the only time they have a whole lot to say is when they stand around multiple people. Only around, only time they come up to you was when you're in a position that you can't do nothing to them. If you was in a position where you could reach out to them, you wouldn't hear a peep. You wouldn't hear this. You wouldn't hear the pin drop. But wait till people come around. Wait till they feel a little comfort. Wait till they feel you're in a position where you you can you at a defenseless position. 
they, they'll start becoming Mighty Joe Young, big silverback gorilla with the big old stripe on them. But when they get by themselves, they go to, you know, Curious George. They instantly turn to Curious George. You just a goofy ass show monkey. But you but when it comes to facing real silverback gorillas, you'll get devoured and chewed, and your bones will be toothpicks. That's why a lot of times we, we stay away from people because we know they're not coming like that in real life. Unless you coming like you do in real life behind the, the masquerade, if, unless you are who you are for, and that's who you are, you're not going to get respect. We're not going to want to deal with you. We're not going to want to be irritated by that. We don't have time for that. Here's my link. Y'all show me some love. Make sure y'all hit that like button too. Y'all show me some love. I'm going to jump into this. Because um, I know y'all wanted me to do some shorter ones, but I'm going to do that. But I'm going to do that for the compatibility videos. I'm going to do some um, uploads. And I'm going to do all the Virgos with the Scorpio together. What I think Taurus with the Scorpio. All about the Taurus. All about the Capricorn. All about the Cancer. I'm going to do all about the Virgo. I'm going to do that on uploads. But when I do the lives, I'm going to go. This going to be more in depth. I'm a, I'm a, when I do lives, it's going to be like raw, straight to it. But when I do like an upload, it's going to be more of a, <clears throat> it's, it's going to be more of like short and compressed. They're going to be a lot more short and compressed like I used to. Because I had to figure out how I wanted to come with it. Because I know how I like to do certain things a certain way. Very different. But at the same time. I don't want to step. I don't want to step out my boundaries. You know what I'm saying. And a lot of these people, they be goofy. Y'all, y'all don't understand. Like a lot of y'all, it's so much I, I be wanting to say to y'all, and so much I want to give to y'all. But a lot of y'all don't understand that that it's a price for for people be like, oh, free speech, free speech. It's a free country. Why they don't just say it? Why they don't just come out and do this? Or why they don't come out and just and say it like that? Or why they don't come out and just put it out like this? Or why they don't come out and just sell it like this? Y'all don't understand. You can't just, it, it comes with a price. Only, only the strong gonna come out and speak up. Only the, only the, the, the real strong spiritual is gonna really stand up. The, the ones that try to act like it, but they seem like they, they, because they are, they not really speaking for y'all. They, they, they are, they are hired helps. They're not they're They, they, they are controlled hands. When we really speak by ourselves, standing on our own two feet with no support, it's us. You know what I'm saying? It's us. So when you deal with us and try to talk to us, we, we, we speaking to y'all for real. We know that we, we don't have that protection. We know we don't have that, that extra hand. You know what I'm saying? So because we, we don't keep a, a circle of people around the, the agree with everything we said. We we, we we keep people around that's going that we know that's going to go against what we say, that we know that's going to give us an argument, that, that we know that's going to give us a clash because it brings a different dynamic. It brings a different uh, honesty. It brings an authentic friendship. It builds an authentic trust because we know they're not coming with anything. We know they don't have no hidden agendas. They, they speak it and they say it and they mean it. But they, but at the same time, it's constructive. It's real. It's, it's love. You know what I'm saying? So when you talk to us, we you we gotta you gotta talk for real. You can't can't beat beat around the bush. Oh yeah, I, I remember what I wanted to get to y'all about too. Make sure y'all like the video too. Make sure y'all like the video. I'm gonna give y'all. I gotta I gotta give that to y'all too, right quick. Hey Kimmy, I'm gonna come on say speak to y'all right quick. Hey Kimmy, hey Annette Gibson, hey beautiful Bella, hey Sarah Carla, hey Miss Strahan, I appreciate. It. Thank you for the love. Thank you. Hey, uh, I'm just getting y'all. If I don't call your name again, it's because I already said it already. Hey, uh, Kazu.
<laughs> people be making accounts and, and, and all that stuff. But I, I ain't mad at them because they 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 doing they they doing their job. That's I guess that's what they, you know, they got to do what they got to do. You know what I'm saying? The enemy's always at work, so we got to stay at work too. You know what I'm saying? They they show their muscle. I'm gonna show my muscle too. You know what I'm saying? It's it's the same thing. We we got to stand on what we stand on because if I was the type of person that wasn't standing on what I was standing on then I'd be easily distracted. I would have been easily thrown up. I'd be like, Ugh! like nah, I'm going to just talk a little smack to you and just brush you to the side. We're we, we not the type of people that's going to keep going on and on with the person in some type of argument or some type of lash out. That's what people get about us. People think we're these, uh, uh, we vindictive. And stuff. No, it takes a lot of energy to be vindictive. It, it takes a lot of energy to be jealous it takes a lot of energy to be a hater it takes a lot of energy to be evil we don't do that because that's we don't have anything to prove we don't feel like we got to prove why do i feel like i got anything to prove to an enemy of mine or to a jealous hater if anything i'll prove to you how much of a loser you are i'll prove, I'll prove to you how jealous you really are i'll prove to you how how pathetic you really are but it ain't gonna i'm not taking no 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 skin off my back in or in order to prove a point no, I'm not going to do that. But during our early stages, I will admit, during our early stages of Scorpio, we will get to a point where we'll step on our own shoes, step on our own shoes, and uh, I know y'all hate when y'all y'all talking. It seems like all the all the chest cold want to come out when you talking. But I guess it's that the engine is just like a furnace burning, it's just breaking everything down. Hey Jennifer Moody, y'all make sure y'all like. I finally get to see you. Oh, yeah, you finally get to see me. That's why I do these at so much at different unorthodox times because it's crazy. It's like when you get the opportunity and you, and you, uh, just like I tell y'all, like a lot of times when we reach out to people, it's like they, they give us all these hard times. They, they play us off cold. They, they either don't answer us back. They don't be direct with us. They be acting weird. Don't don't y'all know how don't y'all hate when y'all y'all try to be direct with somebody? You, you ain't saying nothing belligerent, you ain't saying nothing ignorant, but you be direct with them and you try to be direct with them or whatever. But at the same time, they'll say you you'll send them a message and there be ain't gotta be nobody impersonal. It could be your 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 brother or your sister or cousin or whatever, and they'll they'll completely ignore your your comment or ignore your your direct message towards them, but they'll post a thousand times after you you directly and blatantly posted something to them or said hello to them. And that, that's that type of BS and bullshit I'd rather stay away from. It don't hurt me. It just it's just more irritating than anything because it's like, like what do you what do you want out of me? Like what do you want from me? Do you want my my attention? Do you want bad attention? Do you want like and it's just a trap. They just looking for you to react to it so they can say, oh see, I did this and I didn't even mean it. And they they'll play past aggressive as though they don't know what the hell they doing. And then when you react to it, they'll they'll play off stupid. They'll play stupid, and then you're looked at as the bad guy. You're looked at as crazy. You looked at as being uh, random. You looked at as being these this evil, harsh person that can't uh, you know that gets moved easily. But they don't. People don't see. People don't see this. People don't understand this, and that's why we keep our circle small. You know, we keep our circle extremely small. You can't. You can barely throw a, a, a dime in it. I circle so damn small, you can barely do, you know, throw a damn dime in it. You know what I'm saying? Let me see. Uh, Serene. Hey, Serene Joy. <clears throat> hey, Sarah Kay. Hey, uh, yeah. Yeah, we gonna... You see, uh, oh, boy, it, it just be crazy, man. It's, these people would just be crazy. They be... They be lonely. They be looking for attention. They be pathetic. You know what I'm saying? They, and they come through just to hate on your boy. You know what I mean? Just to give me a hard time by just to, you know, get some type of reaction out of me. And that's why a lot of times you be like, oh, oh my Scorpio, he, he's, he's, um, I sent him a bunch of mess, and you know, I sent him a, a bunch of posts. I, I, y'all say, oh, I send you. I, I do this and do that, but he he won't post this or he won't share this or he won't say that in public or he'll do, do certain things, but he won't do certain things in a public view because 
just like I told y'all, we're not the type that's going to feel like we have to prove a point. I feel like we have to <clears throat> show the world how in love we are. Show the world how cool we are. Show the world uh, how tough we are. Show the world this. Show the world that uh, I'm in love. Oh, I'm hungry. Uh I dress nice, or oh, I'm not dressing nice, or oh, I feel bad, or oh, I hate, I hate this, uh, I hate that, I like this, and I like that. A lot of stuff ain't nobody business. It's your personal business. We don't feel like we have to share everything just to prove a point. We're not. He's not going to be the type of individual that's going to say something just because it's the the nice thing to do. I I put it just because it, it seems like it's the nice thing to do. We don't mind up doing things because it's the nice thing to do, but. We're not going to do it because it's the quote unquote nice thing to do. We're not going to do it because the world thinks it's a nice thing. If we do something nice, it's because we know it's a nice thing to do, not because we feel it's a nice thing to do. Or it's going to appear to be a nice thing to do. Or the outside world going to look at us like we're these nice people. We could give less than a damn, less than two fucks of how anybody looks at us, period. But if it's, if it's, us it's us if it's not it's not that's just how we are we are who we are and we we're not who we're not we you know we're the type we'd rather be hated for who we are than love for who we're not you know what i'm saying because it makes no sense for me to pretend in some type of fake imagery of make-believe in order to prove to somebody that hates me already <laughs> like like what kind of sense do that make that's that's insecurity don't ever live in anybody oh let me jump into this right quick man y'all gonna mess me up man Y'all make sure y'all hit that like button. Y'all want me to keep y'all want me to keep going. I see 38 people in here. Y'all want me to keep going. I need eight more likes, at least eight more. Y'all want me to keep going. Y'all show me y'all want me to keep going. Show that love. Show that like. Hit that like button. Y'all want to share that. Want me to share that love. Y'all hit that like. Y'all show that love. Hit that, hit that joint. Y'all want me to keep going. Show me. You know what I'm saying? Don't don't just look at the screen and be like, oh, you don't see me. Yeah, I see. I see you. You ain't hit the like button yet. Hit the like button. You too. I'm, I'm talking to you too. Yeah, you over there. Yeah, you too. Hit, hit that like button. Show that love. Don't be like that. Don't be like that. Some people. Some people won't do stuff just because. Just because. Like shit. I'm going. I ain't gotta hit no like button. You ain't talking to me. You ain't talking to me. I ain't gonna do it. Like show that love, man. Stop being petty. You know what I mean. Stop being petty. Hit that like button, show that love, man, because it helps get the word out there. It helps get the notifications. It helps get the video out there. So by you hitting the like, it's like it's like it's like hitting the share button for real, for real. So y'all make sure y'all hit that like. Yeah, show that like, show that love. Make sure y'all show that love. I appreciate that. I appreciate the love. Y'all make sure y'all show that serene joy. Hey, F uh, Garden, thanks for sharing like. I appreciate. That. Hey, True King, what's up, True King? Uh, <clears throat> just like I told y'all, because I know a lot of y'all didn't pay attention last <clears throat> last time. But um, y'all, y'all reach. I mean, a lot of y'all be trying to reach out to me and stuff like that. But I just try to be a little bit more careful. So if you want to, you know, reach out to me, whatever, just reach out to me behind the scenes, uh, and um, I'm gonna put my email in. Cause a lot of y'all I be reaching out to, a lot of y'all just have a certain weird type of way of communicating. And you got to understand when you communicate like that and you're very indirect and very uh, uh, indecisive and you're very past aggressive and you're very detached, you're not going to last long with him because he's going to be very blunt. He's going to be very stern and he's going to be very serious. Not because he's not because he's trying to be evil towards you, towards you, because he's trying to be very real towards you. I told you we're not the type of people that's going to show our bad side eight years into the marriage. Oh, I didn't know. I did not know him. I just didn't know him. He was just, oh, I, I thought I knew him. I've been with him for 20 years. And he just, the lies, the deceit, the betrayal. You won't get that out of us because because we'll, we'll throw dog shit right on your plate, right while you're looking right dead at us. We're not going to hide it. <laughs> we're not going to. So we're not going to toss a rock and then hide our hand. No, we'll do it right in front of your face. We'll smack you with the rock right in front of your face and, and, and leave the damage right there. And we're very honest, even if it's brutally honest. We're very honest. We're not going to We're not gonna have to snake you like a snake. No, nah, you you're making mistaking us for Aquarius or 
one of those other people or, or somebody that that's not very direct. We're not we're not like that. We're very direct. We're not hiding behind some club. For for the real ones, I ain't talking about all of us. We're not hiding behind like playing past aggressive. We're not. I'm very direct because I know they they tell you and and like I wish I could go in for y'all. I wish I could just. I'm, that's how I can say I got to make write this book because I got it's so much I got to give out to y'all. It's so much real deep stuff because I know y'all be like, oh, you're some some of y'all anyway. The real viewers don't say this, but some of y'all be like, uh, this and that, and I, I pay attention to someone because you've been desensitized, whether you realize it or not. If you can't sit and watch a video for an hour, you've been desensitized. You've been detached. The the internet and technology has <clears throat> almost desensitized you to an attention span of a five-year-old. You don't realize it. You need to work on it. I, I apologize about that. I'm sorry I can't cookie cut this for you. I'm sorry I can't give you a a, a, a short a coloring book. I'm sorry it's an a encyclopedia. I told you, if you want a coloring book, you got to find a coloring book page. Find a coloring book channel. But if you're if you're more complex, if you're more intellectual, if you're more spiritual, if you're more in depth, if you're more in depth with the truth and reality, you're at the right spot. If you have a, a, a mind of thinking outside the box and have a complex way of putting things and thinking, that's right. You're in the right spot. But if you if you want the regular based out easy to swallow, easy to chew type of stuff, then you need to go down, step it to the more the baby channels or something like that. But if you're, if you're ready to hit the hard stuff and hit the tough walls, I'm going to help you with that. We gonna be, Man, you're at the right spot. Let me see. Uh, I'm going to hit my, give you my, my link one, one more time. <clears throat> show y'all. Oh, yeah, y'all show that love because I appreciate it and, and it helps it helps me get a lot of stuff done. It helps me get a lot of equipment. You know, y'all help me, you know, advance this channel. Y'all help me move it along. It help me put it right back on the right track. So everything counts. Everything is taken into the right spots. You know, I've been I was able to get my uh, stand and just do certain things and get my light in. I appreciate all the love because when y'all do that, y'all help me. Um, advance the channel and make the quality better. Like, you don't see me with no shaky camera. Uh, you don't see me uh, acting like a weirdo uh, uh, doing this and uh, doing that. I'm going to be real with y'all. You no, know, I ain't, I ain't, you ain't going to never see me coming up here on no spazzing. If I'm spazzing, I'm spazzing, period. I spazz when the camera's off. I spazz when it's on. It's not going to change. Just like people be like, oh, God, but they be surprised. They be like, damn, man, you come off the same way you come off in public on the on the camera because I'm like I'm being myself. It's easier to, for me to be myself than to than to play into some role or, or be some some fake weirdo. You know what I'm saying? I don't do that. And that's how you gotta understand when it comes to Scorpio, man. You gotta understand you're dealing with a very blunt individual. You're dealing with a very grounded individual. I'm gonna try to hit some of these points right quick. It's crazy. I, every time I I want to hit the points, I don't even hit them. It's almost like it's, it's just. It's weird. I don't even, I didn't even hit my notes. I thought I needed notes. I didn't even use no notes. But when I don't have them, like I, I didn't have it for my last video, so I felt like, I don't know, maybe it's just like a like a cushion that you don't need, but you feel like, it, it you know, it's just like a helmet. You might need it. You never know when it's going to come in, in handy. But uh, just understand, when you're dealing with Scorpio, man, you're dealing with an extremely tough individual you know, you're dealing with an individual that's no stranger to pain. You're dealing with an individual that's been through hell and back. You're dealing with an individual that has all types of bumps in the road, that's been um, that's been left for dead, that's been um, hated, that's been uh, thrown at, that's been isolated, that's been treated poorly, that's been given all the worst aspects of life. So you're not dealing with an individual that's not experienced. You're dealing with an individual that's very in tune, very in depth with who he is very in-depth in with what life is, very in-depth with where he's going and where he needs to be going, you know, very in-depth with his past. Because I told y'all, we are, are very deep contemplators. We are very deep thinkers. So, like, when people 
uh, I'll be like, oh, you never went through this. Uh, you, you don't know what I mean. Uh, you don't understand. Uh, it, it's just going to annoy us because we do. I know what you mean. You know exactly what you mean. We had not only we know exactly what you mean. We had enough time to sit there and think about what you meant. We're not the type that the people that's distracted by all these distractions in life that don't know who we are, that are trying to find ourselves. We, 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 no, we very in tune. I told you when you're talking to a, a, a 10 year old Scorpio, it's like you probably talking to a 30 year old Scorpio. Talking to a 30 year old Scorpio is like you're talking to a 70 year old Scorpio. It's like we age differently. We don't think differently. We have a different wisdom. We have a different mindset. You're not going to get what you see. It's, what you see is, is like you're going to get something beyond what you think. You're not going to get, oh, you're not gonna get on oh, me talking about gossip or me talking about sports. When you talk about to me, I'm gonna talk about some some uh philosophy. I'm gonna talk about, you know, uh the Marcus Garvey. I'm gonna talk about I'm gonna talk about spiritual, you know, direction. I'm gonna talk about the brothers of truth. I'm talking about real stuff. I'm talking about health. I'm gonna talk about real health. I ain't talking about that fake health. I'm talking about getting real healthy, organic health. I'm gonna talk about real stuff. I'm not talking about what you think I'm going to talk about because I'm young. I'm not going to feel the way you feel like because I'm young. A lot of people, they, that's why that's why this country have made it so easy because in this country, we love to categorize stuff. And we and people almost aggressively put you in this category like, oh, you're Generation X, so you're going to be like this, that, and the third. But this man, this man act like he born in 1980, uh, act like he was born in 1987. He act younger than his son. Uh, this guy over here, he's he's uh 19, but he act like he's 87 years old. He read he reads 18th century literature and listen to easy listening music all day. He don't even know who's the rapper who who's the top 20 rappers right now. But you'll put him in a in the millennium category because of his age. How how blindly blatantly stereotypical and hypocritical is that? It's like, huh? You you make. A couple of bad apples put everybody into a category. Okay, since this person, the because uh, these news reports are putting out this, that, and the third, we're going to put it on this. You're stamped. You're stamped for life. You're you're a negro now. Don't forget that you're a negro. You're, you know how in the movie Malcolm X he said he said you want to be a lawyer. Uh, and he said Malcolm, you're a nigger, and you know that's not a real uh uh job when talking about being a nigger. And, and he was like. Like he looking at him like, I know this motherfucker ain't telling me I can't be because I'm black, and it's just the same. It's the same thing. It's the same thing. Y'all, y'all be like, it ain't that serious. Oh hell yeah, is that serious? How would you feel like? Oh y'all great. How would you feel every time you coming up to somebody? Oh y'all that generation X. Y'all old heads. Get the fuck out of here, old head. Get the fuck up out of here, you great depressionist. Get the fuck up out of here, you civil right. It's go read a Martin Luther King speech or something. Get out of here. Go march somewhere and end up doing absolutely nothing. Go write a speech for eight hours and end up get, reaching absolutely nobody. You have 18 million people liking your page. You have 50 million viewers. You have, and you'll be on front page. At least you got you, right? You ain't really made no difference, but at least you at least you made some money in the process. Yeah. At least you, you were very political and analytical. Yeah. But you ain't make a difference. You ain't help nobody. You ain't save nobody. You ain't educate nobody. You ain't teach nobody. You ain't groundbreak nobody. You ain't tear down the walls. You ain't teach nobody. But you made a speech. You know, it's it's so many things that people can really be pick at, man. And that's why I understand why people like Marcus Garvey, like Malcolm X, like these people were very pissed off with the generations of their time because they were so foolish at them. They were so busy bickering about crumbs. Y'all done forgot the whole damn cake. You so busy picking about the whole, y'all so busy worrying about the frosting, you done forgot the whole damn cake. You so busy about who name gonna be written on, on the thing, y'all forget, y'all neglected the whole project. You so worried about a couple of lines on a, on a bar, or on a couple of songs, y'all forgot the whole album. You forgot a whole, you forgot, uh, just because y'all bickering on a couple of scenes, Y'all throwing out the whole film? It just don't make no sense. It's like everything is cookie cutter. Everything has to be in a certain line. Everything's got to be, oh, this, like, like yo. Like, why people don't get real? People don't just, just get off of that. 
Well, if you don't want to be judged and if you don't want to be looked at in a, in a certain light, if you want to be held at a certain respect, you have to show that respect. You can't label, I can, even me, and I'm young myself, I can't sit here and look at my little brother and be like, man, y'all little youngest don't know nothing. Because, hell, he can take a cell phone and put it apart. I can't do that. He can he can do certain things on the internet that I never even thought of. I can't do that. It's certain it's certain certain things that I can do yet that he don't know about because he didn't learn from it, but and he ain't been through it. But that's because he experiences experiences the spirit of a person. Every individual is an individual. Every person is a different person. I'm not gonna put you in that category because you're a little young. I'm not gonna put all y'all in the category because it's a couple of fools out here putting out a bad name. I'm not going to put, because a couple of news channels put out a couple of bad reports on a couple of people. I'm going to take that for the, the Bible. Some of y'all take that stuff for, like, it's the gospel truth. Some of y'all take that stuff and eat it as though that's it. Y'all, it's just like, just like me saying, I put dog shit on the buffet. I, I put two trays of dog shit on the buffet, but it's crab, it's crab legs, it's steak, it's filet mignon, it's cheesecake, it's macaroni and cheese. It's all this, is that, but all y'all eating is the dog shit. All y'all looking at is the dog shit. You be like, I don't fuck with him. I ain't never going back there because he put dog shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's all y'all see. Y'all don't see. Y'all don't see. It's all this. No, I ain't gonna say dog shit because that might be too strong. I ain't gonna say dog shit. It, say I put two empty trays out, but all but it's it's twenty trays of food. It's steak. You got steak. You got crab. You got shrimp. You got uh, asparagus. You got uh, you got pizza. You got stuff for the kids. But I, it's two trays I didn't get to fill up. I got two trays that's empty. You know, you know, some people would complain the whole time about those two empty trays. You're like, oh, he shouldn't even put them out here if there won't be no food on them. It's it's a hundred different things for y'all to eat, but this is the only thing you see. Everybody, y'all ate up everything else, but y'all still gonna complain. Y'all, y'all got the best. You, you got your money's worth plus that much more, but you still gonna criticize? It's the same thing. It's the same thing. So it's it's, it's that's how I look at it. That's how because so many people are so hypocritical. So many people are so biased. I'm not gonna be biased because I'm a little bit older than him. I'm not gonna stick on his side because oh he's my age. Oh fuck that. He might be an asshole. He might not know shit. I'm going to stick with this young man because he, he's a truth teller. He's a truth speaker. He has a spirit in him. He knows what the hell he's talking about. He might be 10 years younger than me, but that brother, he knows what the hell he's talking about more than this fool. And he might be 20 years older than me. He don't have he don't have a an ounce of sense. You can put his brain in a bird and that bitch going to fly backwards because he ain't got no sense. He's stupid. It don't got nothing to do with age. It got something to do with spirit. It got something to do with experience. It got something to do with wisdom. It don't got nothing to do with no numbers. You can be a you can be an eighty year old fool and wear your drawers on your head and not have an ounce of sense, but you could be a sixteen year old genius with a business running excellent with with paper in your pocket, paper always in your pocket. I'm, I I ain't got a gray hair on my head, but I bet you I know what the hell I'm doing. And I know where the hell I'm going. I bet that, I bet you that. I bet you. Let me see. Um, be all gonna be like y'all young boys, y'all old heads. I'm not gonna do that. I'm, I'm, I'm not just gonna speak on old people. I'm gonna speak on the young one too. I'm not gonna speak on just this and that. I'm not gonna speak to this and not speak to them. I'm not gonna be biased. I'm not scared to approach anybody in the same way I approach one person. Some people talk mess, uh, talk a certain way to younger people because they feel they they have a certain inferiority about them. And they feel like they have a certain superiority over them because of their age. That don't give you no super. That don't make you superior. There's, there's God. There's prophets the Lord took the strip from. Look at the story of Saul and, and uh, what's his name, Joseph. See how how the blessings of of Saul were ripped, were stripped. The Lord. He seen he was acting like an old fool. He was jealous. He was murderous. He was evil. He was dark. And he was conniving. So the Lord took all his, he took his gifts and gave it to a younger prophet. Not because, he, not because he had more wisdom or more knowledge or more age, because he had more spirit. He had, he was in the right direction. Your age don't mean, don't mean a hill of beans to the Lord. What makes you think it's going to mean a hill of beans to anybody else? You're the only one that's counting numbers. 
I'm, nobody else is going to be looking at that. That's why it's, it's so, it's just another thing to keep us separate. Oh, I'm this, I'm that. You're in this category. You're in that category. I'm going to stay in this category because you're that color. I'm this color. I'm that height. I'm this height. I talk like this. I look like that. I act like this. I act like that. It's like, it's just another way to, to separate people, to, to keep people in a, in a certain ignorance, to keep people blind, to keep people ridiculous, to keep people stupid. Because I know I had a lot more to give y'all than this, but I, I had to really break it down for y'all a little bit today. I, I, I gotta, I'm going to put this in a whole nother video because I ain't going to overextend it because y'all be giving y'all be getting on me about my length sometimes. But I give it to y'all because I told y'all my testimony is my testimony. You know, I'm a walking spirit. I'm almost like a walking spirit. I'm not, I know I'm not supposed to be here. I know I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I done lived a life. It's just, it is what it is. Right in front of me, like I could literally feel the spirit busting out my body. Don't know where it was headed, but I could literally feel the, the ghost shooting from my body. So at this point, I feel like, you know how it said when people hit that, 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 that close realm of life, you know you don't have that much time. It's like you feel this urgent, urgency of time. I, I'm living on borrowed time. I know I'm blessed. I know I'm a walking testimony. That's why you see this energy. That's why you see these length of videos. I could easily do 10 minute bits and stuff like that, but I have I have so much to give than 10 minutes because every day is not promised. That's why I'm so passionate. That's why I'm so aggressive. That's why I'm so real because I'm li I'm I'm giving y'all, I'm speaking as though I don't have another day to speak. And that's how I come with it. That's how I come with it every time. That's how every time I'm gonna come with it. If it takes you a while to get the full grasp of the video or you got to watch a little bit and come back. That's fine. But I can't sit here and, and, and baby spoon feed you like you babies, like you some type of intellectual babies. You're not intellectual babies. You're intellectual adults. You're intellectually grown. So I'm going to give you an intellectually grown mad brain food, spirit food, you know, act food. You know what I'm saying? We got, we got, I hit all categories because some people hit all, all points. They, they get more views to me. They get more everything, but they ain't not they not gonna have an impact like me. People ain't gonna remember them like me. People are not gonna gonna enjoy their stuff like they enjoy mine because it's it's the authentic. It's authentic. You can't separate that. You can't separate that. Real gonna be real. You're gonna touch the people. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna always reach the right people. It might not reach a, a, a mass appeal of people, but it's gonna reach the right people. And I'd rather keep it like that, you know what I'm saying? Just like Tracy Chapman, you know what I'm saying? You know, the hunger is of the soul, so I have to feed it. So I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. I appreciate all the love. Um, I, I hope y'all learned a lot about Scorpio communication. Matter of fact, I do a part two for y'all this weekend. I'm going to go and do something totally different. You know, I always want to throw something in the, in the, you know, in the equation. Y'all know how I do, but I love y'all. Make sure y'all hit that like button. Y'all make sure y'all show that love. Thank y'all. Make sure y'all... Um, you know, show that love, hit my PayPal, show some love, donate, show me that love, keep me encouraged, um, share the video, hit the like, and just just hit that like. And I don't, I, like, it don't even make a big deal about sharing so much, but I appreciate it about sharing, but hit that like button and comment, hit that like button, comment, reach out to me, because that means everything. So I love y'all so much. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. I appreciate all the love. You know, all my homeboys, Dap Dap, True King, Slap Slap. I appreciate all the love, half ass. All the brothers, thank you, you know, saying pounds. And all the ladies, you know, big kiss, mm, mm, big kisses. I love y'all. I appreciate y'all so much. Thank you so much for all the love. Thank you so much for all the appreciation. Thank you so much for your undivided attention. Thank you for everything. I don't ever take that for granted. That's why I give y'all this like this. That's why I come at y'all like this because I, I know, you know what I'm saying? I'm speaking. It's like I feel like I'm the voice of the of that child that's in the hospital that's down right now. I feel like I'm the voice of that that old that that young man that got killed yesterday because somebody was jealous with him. I feel like I'm their voice. I feel like I'm the I'm the the last voice. I'm their last hope. I feel like I'm the last hope of the unspoken. I feel like you know, it's it's a weird thing. Only Scorpios 
not, I ain't gonna just say that, but Scorpios can really understand what I feel. It's like it sounds weird, but it's like I feel like I'm a like I'm a medium for a vo the voiceless of of the 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 real spirits of this earth that were slaughtered and murdered and killed and left for dead and voiceless. I'm their I'm their second chance. I'm their breath of fresh air. I'm their their vessel to see the light of you know feel the sunshine one more time. So I'm their their second chance. You know I know I know you know it's it's so crazy. I know it's so hard to understand that sometimes, but it it is. Uh, I don't mean it like a no creepy thing or nothing like that, but it's like. I feel like it's like I'm like a second chance, you know what I'm saying? I'm like a second, not just for my own life, but for the voices of other two figures, the voices of many other uh, followers of light, of followers of the Lord, followers of reality, followers of truth. So we got to keep it and hold it, keep the torch burning, keep it going. But I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. I appreciate it. Tune in. Stay tuned. Thank you so much, Eve Miller. Let me make sure I get every all my shout outs. Eve Miller, thank you, uh, Kimmy. Um, I, I said everybody else. That's one reason I'm glad I said everything else in the beginning as I as I keep going. Uh, thank you, El Retardo, for being a, a dick, you piece of crap. And uh, I appreciate just everything. Thank you so much. I appreciate all the love. I appreciate all the appreciation. I appreciate all the hate. I appreciate all the pettiness. I appreciate all the devotion, all the devoted love of, of my um, wonderful support. Just thank you so much. I love y'all. And I withdrawn. Hey, what's good? Hey, hey, uh, withdrawn for peace. That's how I feel. Withdrawn for peace. Hey, I might even use that as a title. I might have to use your name as a title, Withdrawn for Peace. I'm 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 gonna have to steal. I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to ear hustle a little bit. I'm gonna have to steal your I'm gonna have to uh piggy I'm gonna have to piggyback your name. Withdrawn for peace. I like that. I think I'm gonna use that as a title for my next video. So I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. Thank you so much. This is why you see the energy I give. This is why you see all this this passion because it's there. It's this who I am. I thank y'all so much. I appreciate the love. And I'm gonna holler at y'all. Thank you so much. And I'm gonna holler at y'all. Peace, love. Y'all stay safe. Y'all stay blessed. Y'all stay supporting. And thank you. Peace. <laughs>